Hello my fellow geeks and this is your boy Lewis with GWH and I'm going to show you how to install iOS 6.1 on your iPod Touch, your iPhone and your iPad. So let's begin by clicking download and install. Hopefully I have enough memory like anybody else does. You have two different buttons, a disagree button and a agree button. I really don't understand why is there a disagree button because you can get right back to the other screen. But, you know, for a second time, click agree. Now it says to save battery, connect your iPod Touch to your power while downloading. Do you want to update later or continue using without power? Um, and let's continue because we like to take risk and I'm a risk taker. Now iOS 6.1 Apple estimated time less than one minute remaining, but that means you know an Apple time is at least two or three minutes depending on how many people are downloading it. But my internet is pretty fast, and I'm just gonna shut up. And welcome back, my fellow geeks. So um, now we can't install this since it's downloading completely. It took about five to ten minutes, so just click the install button. And once again, you be prompt with disagree or agree, so just click agree. It just say verify update. It should verify completely successfully without any issues whatsoever. As long as you have over 50% of battery health and or it's plugged up to your computer or outlet. And once again, I welcome you back. So it has completely restarted, downloaded, installed, and restarted again to this screen right here. Don't worry, it's not frozen. I'm sorry for all these little clips and sound quality all that crap but you know what it's almost done so you know stay tuned to the next all right welcome back and like i said lewis back with gwh and now it's time to install ios 6 on my ipod touch 4g um so pass over right there you all even need it um it says update completed let me zoom in for y'all your iPod Touch was updated successfully. There are just a few more steps to follow and then you're done. And let's continue. Hopefully you still in focus. Continue. Alright. To finish setting up your iCloud, your iMessage, and FaceTime into the Apple ID password for my email. Once it has, you know, it says um, successfully, if you put your password, it's just say you updated the iCloud settings to look like um, iOS 6.1 is really using iCloud to the best of visibility, which is awesome because everything I have is updated to iCloud. And now you can just click start using your iPod Touch. And that's pretty much how you install and set up iOS 6 on your iPod Touch, your iPhone, your iPad. If you do like this video, please give this a thumbs up, comment below, share with others, and subscribe for more. Till next time, this is your boy Lewis with GWH signing off.